Hey guys, this is Coffee Chug. How you doing? Here with another maker tip. Today I want to share, you've probably seen many Lego hacks before, using push pins and some Lego minifigs. So let me figure out which minifig. Hmm. I think I'll go, he seems like a good one. And this guy. <laughs> okay. So a cool thing, it's not really a makerspace hack so much, but it, it can be in a couple different ways. And so one of the things you can do, if you've got bulletin boards or things of a display, is you can use some super glue and super glue a push pin to the back of a Lego minifig. I'm just gonna use hot glue. Because I use hot glue for everything. And I'm just gonna push that on there to the back and we'll let him dry there. And then what you do if you have probably seen a million times, one, it adds a little decor and decoration to your design space, whatever it is that you've got. Um, but second, you now have things, a push pin that can hold things up obviously on your cork board or your wall. But secondly, you know you can use their hands then to hold wires and cables. And so these guys are great for holding phone cables or little, little small wires like that. And so now you can build in a portable storage solution where if you have cables that kind of come and go, they can clip on and hold that. You can get them up out of bins, off the floor, hang up on the wall, and they can simply just pull the minifig off the cork board when they need it, use it, and then stick it back on the wall when they're done. So a simple tip using Lego minifigs, not just for push pins to hold up your kids awesome work and decorations, but also to multi-use it to get things off the floor and tables and up on the wall. All right guys, hope you found this tip useful. Let me know what else you think, tips, tricks, and tricks. Until next time, stay awesome.